everyone. Welcome to the match day vlog. Everton versus Manchester United are going to be an interesting one. Liverpool have just lost 3 2 to Arsenal. This could be our chance to overtake them in the league. I'm not going to jinx it. I'm not going to go, oh, but anyway, score prediction. We're going to go straight into it. We're going to go 2 1 Everton. Either 2 1 or a 1 0. I don't know, but I think we'll get a win. How about you, Div Dad? Oh, I tell you now, as a Liverpoolian, I'm a bit peed off, but I think Everton have got it 3 2. 3 2. Oh, I'd I, I love that 3 2. But I think Everton got solid defence and. United not playing Ronaldo again, he's on the bench. Um, so that's a big coincidence. Haven't got a coach welcoming, been busy today, but hopefully, you know, we'll still win. Hopefully, I haven't jinxed us by not going to coach Aston, which it's not true anyway. I'm being daft, I am being daft. But don't forget to like, subscribe, and if the membership options have come in, drop me a little membership sub, maybe if you just want. Sub to use, but it'll be absolutely class. This game, oh, I can't wait. Calvin's on the bench again. Mo is in up front. We're on form, unbeaten. So we have got a very big chance on winning. I got laughed at on TikTok for saying Everton was win. So fingers crossed. But we've got all chances of winning. We won them last season. We would have, we've been unbeaten against United for the last two seasons now in the league. So come on, let's have it. Come on. <laughs> Doesn't think Calvin was on the pitch with his injury prone. Neither do I. But we're gonna have to see how that gets on then. But yeah, if you haven't liked the other vlogs as well on my channel the last two vlogs, drop them a like. Oh, fucking knobhead. Look at this fucking twat. It's there. Fucking comes out of a random space. Like, at speed. Why would you do that? He's all over the road. Yeah, he's been at the Mons, speeding. And he is definitely drunk, 100%. Just comes flying out at speed. What a tit. <laughs> Times with you, say bye. Clayton Park, what else? It's sensational. Just uh, the meat inside. It's tasty. 10 out of 10. Oh, oh come on, come on. Can I give it another way like that? Oh, 
didn't need it last long. Jane Nantley knew he'd score, he's a good player. Scored now three in the Premier League already, out of like four games. He's something else, Jane Nantley, honestly. We need to stop this, we keep giving the ball away in them areas, all the time. Costs us for the first goal. Why is he going on his own, help him? There's no pressure here. Come on. Casemiro's even from CDM all the way up there in the attacking half. Just fuck all about it. CDM yeah, done nothing. The United's defence looks shaky, but we're not pressing it enough. So frustrating.
goes whatsoever. Keep giving the ball away to United. They're doing slocking mistakes in the fence. Two minutes of added time and it's frustrating. We, we've done not a good do mistakes all game. Scored a very good goal, make it 1-0, then done not with mistakes. United's defence have been doing mistakes, but we haven't capitalised off any of that. We just get the ball straight to them, which is what we've just done. And then we'll be just easily got off the ball. Just missing Nathan Patterson as well, honestly. Oh. Half time, 2 1 United. United have changed their rounds. As you'd expect with the team they've got, but it's no excuse. We've been poor, very poor, by the goal we've scored. United, like I've said, United make mistakes, we're not capitalising from it. I hope we can change in the second half. We did against Southampton. Well, that was a different situation, I don't know, but... Uh, not happy. What are we doing? And that defence just looks totally different when Coleman's there. It's very worrying, to be honest with you. But... Yeah, 2 one after that. No other words, really. What did to say? Just need to get a move on. Come on, Toffee. Let's have a better second half. One more. Come on, that's better. Oh, come on, come on. Not that well, too easy. Oh, come on. Oh, shit. Can I just keep doing that? Same mistake all the time. I need to capitalise. Oh, oh. Go down the late half. Come on. Oh, I think just keep staying off. Turns off. Right, we're in a corner. It's just, I don't understand what's happening with the corner. Oh. Take a draw, 
got to be from Gauls and get it. We've had a better second half. We have, but United still get the spaces. We haven't finished off our chances. I don't know. I just have to draw. One or two, two. One or three, two. We can see that. It's about like 15 minutes to go, so. Holman's coming off. James Garner is coming off. First game, you let him around the floor. And the club captain, Holman, as well. And a decision has finally gone against Man United. And, and for us, first time in history that way. Mo pay off, Rondon on Keaton Ranch, sure be happy, but what's this sub about? What's he gonna do, Rondon? As long as he can support Pablo Roy. Referee is oh my god. Giving us a foul. For once, get in.
So yeah, full time. Everton won United 2. I still went and just not happy with the results. We won them last season 1 0. Gordon had an awful game. For me, them subs should have come on earlier. We did change the game with them subs. They didn't make an impact. The midfield wasn't on point at times, but you know, everyone gets beat. You know, we had an unbeaten streak in like seven games in all competitions, so it's bound to happen sometime. And to me, I think we played very really good in the last 20 minutes of the game, just didn't capitalise. And the referee was poor. You know, see how, yeah, how many times did he time waste? How many times did their fellas rag our players not get a card? And that's why I don't want to take the piss out of Liverpool losing against Arsenal because for the fact about this result in case we got absolutely we didn't get battered, but in case we got beat. But it happens, every team gets beat, and that's what we've got to think about. But yeah. Need to focus on the next game, I suppose, the way I thought. Anyway, thanks everyone for watching Match Day Vlog. I'll be back tomorrow. AFC Liverpool versus South Shields in the FA Youth Cup, the under 18s. If I don't go to that, which I don't mind, because I don't, then I'll be at Tuesday, Big and Blackburn. Hopefully, the Blackburn end, because at least I have some atmosphere. But I wish we would have won that, but win some, lose some, stick by the team, you know. Gutted that we didn't get the three points. I think we did deserve at least a point. Again, we played good in the second half. First half, we didn't deserve anything. But, you know, it won't be his mistake. It cost us in the you know, same manner. But at the same time, I'm not going to go off at a Roby, say, oh, look, a Roby, you're to fall when he's not. Because he's just, you know, he's a good player. And he's, again, apart from that one mistake, he had a good game. Scored a really good goal on track. Just move on next week against Tottenham. Hopefully we get a point out of that. I think it's possible because Tottenham's form has been up and down. They're not exactly the most attacking side. Could get a point out of that. But for me, Carver Lumen's got to start. And yeah, if anyone can only get a ticket for the Tottenham or Newcastle game, either one, I don't mind. I like that because they're sold out and yeah, they're very hard to get. But I'll be on away day soon, hopefully even Bournemouth from the Carabao Cup, hopefully let's think. Because I don't think that that will sell out that quick, but for me, the dogs is out. And yeah, got beat to one. And just a bit gutted, that's all. Like, subscribe, subscribe to the membership if it's a beard, I don't know. Legends.